Hello, calculus students. Okay, we're going to solve this problem here. We're going to find the equation of the tangent line to this curve at a point. So um, we're given a point, so uh, I'm going to write the equation of a line. And since this is a tangent line, we'll have to compute the slope. And recall that the slope is given by the derivative of this curve evaluated at the given value for x, which is pi. Okay, so um, I'll do the easiest thing first here. I'll just substitute the value for y1 and x1. So y1 is minus 3 pi. So I'll put that in, and x is pi. Okay, so now that I have those substituted, I'll just simplify a little bit. All right, now I need to uh, compute the slope, so I will take the derivative of this curve, and um, so I will need to use the product rule. So I'll take the derivative of the first term uh, times the second term left alone, then I'll take the derivative of the second term times the first term left alone. All right, derivative of 3x is 3. I have cosine x because that's left alone. Plus 3x and the derivative of cosine x is minus sine x. I'll just simplify that a little bit. So I have 3 cosine x minus 3x sine x, and now we're going to evaluate this derivative at pi to get the slope. So the slope will be 3 cosine pi minus 3 pi sine pi, but we know that the derivative of, uh, I'm sorry, that the sine of pi is 0, so this whole term is zero, and so that leaves us with three times cosine pi, but the cosine pi is minus one, so the slope is minus three. So let's take this equation for the line here, and let's substitute the value for the slope that we just found, uh, which is minus three. And let's distribute and simplify. So minus 3x, and then minus 3 times minus pi is plus 3 pi. Mm, minus 3 pi. And, uh, well, what do you know here? If I simplify this expression, I get y equals minus 3x plus 0. Because minus 3 pi and plus 3 pi is zero. So that means that the slope is minus three and the y-intercept is zero. All right, good luck.